Hey guys, welcome to episode 6 of Cancol, uh, Freedom of the Sky and Sea. Thank you, Kelso, for your subscribe, literally right as the stream started. And, uh, you know, we've got all these wonderful people here. Sorry we weren't here last week, but we had someone that was sick, and that's actually been happening to a lot of my cast, so I think California is probably just infected with something. <laughs> uh, and I know Texas is infected with something because Radosaurus went and said that Solo was a good movie. Uh, so definitely got some. Maybe I can be his oh, friend. Again. He's being wow. ejected from the club. Yeah, rough life, but we have to do it. All right, now I think the cameras are a little bit more centered. There we go. Uh, E3 is happening right now. It basically sucks more or less. Uh, Microsoft had the only good showing so far. I guess Devolver Digital got people with a bunch of memes, but that was about it. Yeah, Devolver's presentation was really entertaining. It was. It was only they only showed like three or four games, but it was hilarious. Uh, Cotton decided to remodel. She just destroyed all the walls in her house, and she's building new ones. Uh, that's pretty much. You know, that's just Don't how they get do it her up mad. there. <laughs> Scary. True. Uh, wow. Feels like it's been a really long time. The overlay is not accurate, by the way. I didn't mark down all of the new levels for everybody. Expect that to be. But we do have new fan art that will be on the the fan art roll on the other screen. Let me flip over to it, where Radosaurus is doing a work in progress of all of the characters. Uh, it's also Shikaku and Sazanami's birthdays happened during our two-week gap. The odds of that happening are extremely low, but, uh, the two birthdays would fall in a two-week time frame, but there it is. And the last thing I have to say before we do introductions is that Rad is trying to draw Sazanami correctly, but every time he goes for references on the internet, he's literally horrified at everything he sees. <laughs> uh... <laughs> Apparently, people lewd Sazanami a lot, which is super weird because she, like, that's the internet. Yeah, it's, All it's... right, on that somber note, let's jump over to, to Sid Alpha. How are you doing, buddy? I'm doing okay. Uh, it's been an interesting weekend. Uh, I got to spend some time hanging out with Arthur and uh, and Henley and Sawfang and and uh eric Volgares. we spent a little time hanging out and and mocked the e3 which is always fun um so far as it was a pretty good showing like arthur said the microsoft one was really smooth i enjoyed it quite a bit not a whole lot of cringe there and some interesting games and i found out i actually found this out today that whole thing where they uh they were trolling everyone with the bethesda conference with the uh the alexa skyrim thing oh that's real that's real I it's didn't even realize that. That was actually a thing. So I loaded up Dude, I loaded I up the Alexa phone you. app. Yeah, Todd Howard even... isn't going to stop until Skyrim is everywhere. So, I yeah, I installed the, the Alexa phone app today, which is free. And I installed so, the Skyrim why app, you say that which name, is free. Man? People listen to this on their speakers. <laughs> What's wrong with you? Excellent. No, it's, it was a lot of fun. I was playing around with it at work. <laughs> I feel like that's a forbidden word. Need to make like Harry Potter and make that a taboo. Alexa, oh, install Skyrim. No, don't do that. <laughs> playing around. Oh that's, boy, that's Sid. messed up. That's messed Ooh. up. <laughs> oh, you get to go in the timeout corner for now, man. That was bad. <laughs> All right, Cotton. How had to be been? done? Well, well, my car broke and my phone terrible. broke. That's also terrible. And. Today, when I got home from work, I found out my puppy that I let roam around the house. Please tell me it's not broke. Let, let my big dog out of his kennel because she figured out how to open the latch and he destroyed oh, wow. everything. Oh, no. Okay. Well, as long as the little dog isn't broke. They're not broke. Okay. She's just too smart. Yeah, I'm right there with you. One of them ate my donut. So. It's always the cats that try to eat my donut. <laughs> oh my god, she seems so sad when you say that. I'm kind of oh. looking forward to it. You know, you can buy another donut. I'm broke because my car oh. broke oh, and the phone true. broke and my dog ate everything. 
Wow, Con. <laughs> Fuck, I'm sorry. sorry. I don't know why I'm laughing. That's a very sad story. I honestly don't know why I'm laughing. <laughs> I know why I'm laughing because it's funny. <laughs> Yes, I am a soulless monster. I've accepted Look, this a long time ago. Cotton, has anything good happened to you recently at all? Please say something. Yes, it helped me get a new mic stand. Oh, excellent. That's pretty cool. I think you need to move the mic a little bit closer to you because I, I, I feel like you're a little softer than everybody else. Is am I wrong better? here? Can anybody? Sounds about the same. Try, try it again. How about now? Oh geez, right up there. <laughs> no, that's great. That was much better. It's great, right there, right there. Yeah, you're you said a lot better. Okay, well, I don't right have there. to hold it there the whole time. You know, I had you have it, do if that you once. have it on if you have it on cardoid, you don't aim it right at you like a bullet. Think of the mic like it still needs to be on a stand facing you. Stream says you're you okay. It's, it's 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 fine. It's okay. Fine. <sighs> Excellent. Good. All right. We'll, we'll, we'll go through it later. Look, Cotton, I hope your life gets better soon. What curses do I put on my art? Whoa, boy. What is, well, that's really bad because I just commissioned Unidus for four map pieces of arts. So, uh, listen, if he gets like hit by lightning or something, I'm going to stop <laughs> making art. I'm just going to have to give See, up on that. This is why I just uh, send you fan art and I, I don't accept commissions ever. Ah. Uh, See, secretly Kelsa agreeable. knew. She knew. <laughs> <laughs> I thought well, I was an art vampire, but in fact, witch to to see the magic of the powerful warlock. It's just <laughs> fine. the thing. All right, Kelsa, how are you doing this week? <laughs> uh, last week I was the one that was sick, but this week I have been very good. I got to uh, finally, for the first time, uh, play. Well, since I bought it. Um, for my brother and then gave it to him for christmas play captain sonar which is a board game where you play up to up to four people on a team so two teams of four for eight people um we only had half that number so it was just two and two but it's like battleship if you could move your pieces around but with multiple players and it's hectic and confusing and I really enjoyed it, and I'm super glad that we got an opportunity to play. Um, other than that, I've... Um, now, do you mean Battleship like the board game or Battleship like the movie Battleship? <laughs> like the board game. Okay, good. The good Battleship. Yes. You're, you're on a submarine, and you're trying to find the other people's submarine. And your radio operator can hear when they move, they have to announce the moves out loud. And so one player on the team, their entire job is to listen to what the other team is saying. when they do a thing out loud and then write it down so that you can use their path to try to find out where they are. Um, Cause they can't, it's, it's interesting and fun. All right, I'm getting in a battle in chat about battleships. Uh, I see that, I see that. <laughs> look, look, the movie was terrible, but Rihanna was okay in it. Uh, just I the whole premise that there's a secret Japanese reserve passive sonar system shaped exactly like a grid uh, was a little weird. You yeah. don't remember that part of the movie? <laughs> That would be a little... No, I never saw the movie. I see. I also never saw Played the video game. Holy crap, did that suck. Mm. I bet. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's it. I Look, I'm not saying there aren't passive sonar systems out there. I mean, Iceland is basically just one gigantic passive sonar system, but <laughs> it's probably not shaped exactly like a grid. Uh, other than that, I've been doing some art. I posted some of that... Uh in the discord so people could put some eyes on it I also tweeted it so that uh even more people could put some eyes on it uh, i'm not a super great artist but i've been having a lot of fun drawing some characters from some other games so all right That's listen I, got on. I wanted to say something super mean here like uh well let's talk to another super not great artist <laughs> uh <laughs> lexi 
Look is a wow. better artist than I am, so. Uh, hi, Arthur. Yeah, what's uh, up? <laughs> How's it going? Going, I was actually going really, really well. Um, I'm right up until that whole art comment. Yeah, you know, like uh, I had a, a look. Great, I, tr I listen. I, I, I was I, trying I had, to had bunt it. Okay, I wasn't going for a home run. I was just kind of letting the ball hit the bat. <laughs> I feel that because I had a had the uh, the script all laid out, and also I was like, huh. um, but yeah, I did do some. Uh, I've been doing some more art lately, uh, which has been really good. It's been uh, great actually, um, and I'm on a big high from coming from our first my first anime and chill with my Patreon on Sunday, where we watched Princess Mononoke, and I think it went really well because uh, we watched the movie. Be able to talk to you know and then afterwards had a nice discussion over you know, the different things in the movie and other things like that uh you know around anime and anime movies and the characters and i think it went really really well um and i definitely look forward to next sunday uh so yeah you know i like i said you know i'm really happy that went off without you know too big of a hitch and yeah things are going really well really, are really you well. saying that since the last time we saw you that you started a patreon <laughs> yes you mean the patreon that's at patreon.com backslash lexi tells patreon.com backslash lexi tells patreon.com backslash lexi listen i'm just going with whatever she says uh, okay forward slash <laughs> patreon forward slash lexi tells i don't want to get to the wrong link <laughs> um but She's yeah saying slash everyone knows slash. what you mean with the slash no, slash i don't know but i'd like to add that extra little you know modifier you know the, the detail details um so yeah uh, i know we y'all voted on the first photo set and it's that sweater virgin killer sweater so there are a bunch of hint ties but um you know that's okay i did offer it as an option but you know y'all could have gone a different direction uh and i'll be getting that out uh should be this week um so yeah it's just been really good uh things are going really well yeah. all right uh cotton i want to mention that you started an art contest and then in like the last four hours of the contest you were like hey guys does anyone want to win a contest i was like you know what i will do a last minute entry because on the last episode of BattleTech. Uh, rapier did some pretty cool shit, so I'm gonna just get a thing of rapier, and then I ended up winning the contest. Pretty nice. Thank you, Hypertrophy, nice. for the sub. Look, that's how you win contests. You enter at the last minute, all the time. Super also entered at the last minute, and she got really close to winning because her name was right by yours, and I just put him in a list and rolled a dice. <laughs> all right, we got anything else we need to talk about? I feel like a lot's happened, but I don't know that anything mm. significant has happened. You know. Anime wise. Oh, Darling and the Franks is back. Yep, Darling and the Franks was back. They took a one week break. Yeah, I forgot and this is the anime good. show. Yeah, well, I mean they did the same thing Trigger always does, which is in the last arc of the show, they're like, everything that you thought was true. Ah! Fuck that shit. Here's the new storyline. <laughs> yup. Yeah. <laughs> and uh oh the new uh sword the new art online gun, gun Gale online that was a really good online. episode that's getting really great that is the it episode is like, that they had to do shit. the recap for remember when they did the recap like two or three mm -hmm. weeks ago they they had to stop the, the show so that they could get that particular episode done on time because of all of the shooting yeah there's a lot there was a lot of mayhem there it was great and the the girl with the the dual grenade launchers Puka. It's pretty damn awesome. Yeah. I mean, that's the problem with that show. She managed to simultaneously become the best and worst girl on the show at the same time within like 30 seconds. Yeah. Yeah. Actually, she did. And now we've now we've got a competition between three women as to who's going to be the best girl, and there's literally not a best guy. I mean, there was a best guy for like 5 seconds when they had the anime version of the Expendables show up, and they were all like, "Hey, what's up? What's going on? It's me, Rocky Balboa." And I was like, is that Dolph Lundgren behind Rocky <laughs> Bell? Is that Jason Statham? Is this for real? And then they're like, oh, hey, I guess we're all dead now. And I'm like, mm, okay, well, they were on screen long enough to make sense, but all right. I don't know. I like M. I do. Of course, you know, he's a huge one piece unfeeling, of 
What the fuck is wrong One with you? Unfeeling monster to a massive another, traitor you know? to everybody. The dude is like, listen, I have no will of my own. I just do what I'm told. And then half the time he's like, betray, betray, yeah, betray. Yeah. Here's ten million dollars to betray somebody else. Like, yeah. He's a horrible, horrible human being and a terrible yeah. character. <laughs> All right, Sid. Of course you would like that kind of character. I mean, it's it, it falls right along with the the pattern of characters that I do like. You know, there's M, there's Zero Two, there. <laughs> I listen, man. Don't I feel even... like if I keep going, I'm gonna no, break just, Arthur. Listen, here just soon. don't even listen. You can't can't mention that name right now. All right, we don't know what's gonna happen. Just can't. Just can't. <coughs> All right. Any other <coughs> any other animes? Video games? Uh, I mean, I got a bunch of games. Has anyone my... watched Solo? No. All right, Kelso, was it yeah, any I good? Yeah, I saw it. Uh, I had fun watching it, but... That wasn't really... really an answer. Uh, but, no, I... Hold on. But I really don't like the actor that got to play young Han Solo. Oh, thank God you said Han Solo. Oh, uh, when you said young, I was like, if she says Lando Calrissian, I'm gonna what? explode. No. I'm gonna explode. The best goddamn character in the whole movie. He was absolutely fantastic. He was the entire reason that I went and watched the movie a second time. Wow, second time. Okay, that's not 100 percent true. It's also partly because after I watched the movie, my lady was like. Oh, I wanted to see that. And I'm like, you never want to see movies. And she's like, yeah, except Star Wars movies. And I was like, okay, I'll see it a second time with you. And then we went back and I watched it in the theater with her too. So oh. it All was right. interesting watching it a second time though, because I, I saw a certain things that I had kind of glanced over before. But uh, at the same time, there's certain parts of that movie that just are not the best. But it's a fun movie. Modern Star Wars movie that isn't the best. Yeah, mm. it's weird. That would explain why they're losing their shirt with that movie, too. I mean, really, my biggest problem is Han Solo's face. <laughs> Someone compared wow. it to the new Dante from The New Devil May Cry. I, don't, I haven't seen that. They were like, he looks like a young YouTuber that I haven't heard of until he says something racist. Oh yeah, that was a, that. That was a person that uh, runs the friggin' uh, uh, damn. I can't even remember what the hell it's called anymore. Yeah, I saw that shit get compared to Han Solo, and I was like, they're right. They do look like Logan Paul or Justin Bieber or Ninja. I still can't believe Ninja is a guy who actually does stuff on the internet. I'd never heard of him before he started saying some racist shit. That's funny. Yeah, I I. I felt like he looked more like a young Michael J. Fox than a young uh, Harrison Ford. I saw one person equate him to a young, uh, to a uh, Hayden Christensen. Mm, I can kind of see that. But um, yeah, it was a, it was a fun romp. Romp? Yeah. Very well. All right. <laughs> You've convinced me. I'm gonna watch it, but only so I can complain about it later. <laughs> uh, there are some. Uh, there are some points that I really, really like, and there are some other points where I'm like, I kind of wish they could have done this a little differently. Look, when I was a kid, I told people I wanted to grow up to be a train engineer. Pro tip: I grew up to be an electrical engineer, which is not the same at all. But <laughs> what I really meant was I wanted to be those two guys from the Muppets that were up in the balcony and made fun of every movie. Uh -huh. uh, and I did grow up to be that guy. So, <laughs> Which one are you? I think you've I, got I'm a combination. Another, you're a combination. I think you've got at least another 40 years, though, before you could be one of those guys. I don't know. I'm feeling just about that salty right now. I mean, you could just spray that, you know, like white hair stuff in your hair. Hmm. I don't need to do that. Don't worry. It's still going white on its own. It's still pretty brown, though. Don't I'm actually getting a lot of gray hair. A Get lot that. of gray hair. I blame my dad because he went, like, white-haired. Uh, I don't know why I didn't make that distinction. 
<laughs> um, in like his like late twenties. <laughs> uh, so. Yeah, I was a little That's upset. I, I went and got my hair cut the other day, and I saw a gray hair in there. That must be a rough. Little, being little a decade freak older out. than me. Oh, by the way, happy birthday, motherfucker! Happy birthday to the ground. I'm, I'm <laughs> almost, almost, uh, yeah. almost older than dirt. <laughs> wow. Well, you know, at least you, you know, you can take sauce, and that you know, dirt gets recycled to the Earth's core every so often. <laughs> <laughs> we're made of star stuff uh yeah were you ready to get started <laughs> all right then uh does anyone remember what happened last time i know it's only been two weeks but there was actually a lot that happened last time mm -hmm. everyone almost died that's true everyone almost died yeah Uh, you don't remember anything else that happened? Not really, no. Okay. All right. <laughs> uh, I remember something about talking to the marine biologist woman, and but mm -hmm. not exactly how that went. Mm -hmm. There's a hentai yeah. sub that came. Yeah. You 5'11". Yeah. yeah it's, it makes sense <laughs> she's a sub. <laughs> <laughs> makes sense she's a sub, but... <laughs> Why? Cause shit. No, I'm not gonna finish that. I'm just not don't. even gonna say it. <laughs> don't. Not even gonna say it. Just don't. It's easier that way. I'll I'll type it. Just don't. What? Why? Do you understand we, what we just don't mean? We all already know. Jesus, Sid. Nande, nande, nande. <sighs> <laughs> wow. Did you put on blush before the show, or is that just nat all natural art? <laughs> How do you see back a little bit for the artist jab, you know? <laughs> uh, and just to remind you guys, we've got new furniture items in the base. Oh, yeah. Because you broke the blockade last time, uh, we're now using all 12 journey types. Uh, and those journey types you can find over here in the corner uh, for the other ones that we haven't used yet. All right, I think that covers everything. So let's start by picking our flagship. Who would like to be the flagship? Does anyone else want to volunteer to be flagship? I'll let you have it. I mean, he does have that ability that makes it, you know, pretty. Yeah, it just makes sense for him to be flagship. Does everyone vote for Sid to be flagship? Okay, Nagato is flagship for the episode. <clears throat> I was super shocked to learn that Sid was the flagship. I can tell. <laughs> How do you hide it so well? Uh, you all start on the base with the sun rising in the background. For the first time in weeks, the base is fully stocked. Uh, there's no siege ongoing. And there's uh, just announcements with the rising sun that the operation to retake SS Island is on and that within the next few days, the Senpai Defense Force will be getting it. So it's Oyeda, so it's just like Senpai Defense Force will be getting orders in the next few days about <clears throat> the operation to retake the fueling point to SS Island. <clears throat> Dinner is curry tonight. That is all. Yeah, curry. Kind Nagato of looks in. very yes, yes. depressed at that. At curry? Don't like spicy uh, things. I offer Nagato a hug. They have, they have mild curry, though, Nagato. For the less adventurous. Nagato, do you accept Sazanami's hug? I feel like it's one of those where I'm standing there and I get, like, sneak attack waist hugged from the side. <laughs> You actually feel a second hug as well when on the other side of you, U511 has attached herself to you as well and is holding hands with Sazanami uh, around your, your stomach. That's the cutest, yeah? U511 reporting for duty. 
But wait, aren't you in a different different uh group? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Guten Tag, guten Tag. Goodness. You, you're back. It's true. I'm back. I feel like we have a cutaway to a slightly less uh, graphically detailed anime with me, like trying to push both their heads away and they're like scrambling. To... <laughs> you just like, that's right, I am back. And even more importantly, I am now flagship of my fleet. First submarine flagship in generation. Congratulations. Thank you, yeah. thank you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The cocky pats you on the head. Good job. Uh, That's so exciting, yeah? So she's going to let go of Nagato and give Shikaku a hug and then be like, yes, thank you, fast lady. <laughs> <laughs> she just blushes like, no, 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 no. I'm not fast. No? No. I heard that you could do 34 knots. I'm like uh, way faster than her and Yao. <laughs> but you're a light cruiser. You're supposed just... to go fast. That's right, Yao. Fast. See, 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 I'm not fast. I'm not a fast lady. So uh, you is going to walk over to you, Tama, and be like, actually, I don't think that we've talked yet. I am you. Tama. Very well. I must now go back to the like, look at the back and forth between. The... <laughs> <laughs> I will see all of you at class later, maybe. Yeah, that sounds like fun, yeah? Today we'll be learning about torpedoes. I love torpedoes. I also love torpedoes. I love torpedoes too. I like initiate a hot three way high five. For sure. <laughs> You're just like. Uh... <laughs> Mm. You're just like, what's wrong, Nagato? You don't like torpedoes? I like them just fine when they're not coming at me. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> uh, so you start, like, military marching away, uh, moving around, it's like, huh, 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 huh. Uh, and singing something in German, but you just keep hearing the word flagship uh, in the middle of it all. Wow, there we go. <laughs> so full of spirit. All right. So let's uh, let's pick your choices for today's themes and scene types. Are there any quests? Uh, I believe there are some outstanding quests from last week. Let me see. Uh, here. I think we still had locate the abyssal agents. Yes, that's the only and... quest that you have remaining. <clears throat> oh, did we finish lost property? Uh, I thought you did. Did you guys not? I mean, uh, we had the expedition. Wait, I have completed. learned more about Hasurumi. Is that Harusami? Yeah, yeah that's, Harusami. That's the her quest was lost property was giving her a memento item. Oh, oh, which we okay. got from the expedition. That's right. Yep. So we did. We did do that one. Uh, so your only outstanding quest is locate abyssal agents of Shortland Harbor. Boop. Why is Shikaku in the sub spot? Uh, actually, I was taking her to my secret spot. <laughs> that sounds bad. Uh, I was yeah. taking her to my... <laughs> oh, my. Uh, and you say you're not a fast ship. <laughs> I mean... <laughs> hmm. uh, she was going pretty quickly. <laughs> she was taking a beeline straight for it. All right. Anyway. But to me, but to me, but to me. Is it, isn't beeline when you zigzag? I thought beeline was going straight. Beeline is to go straight. Is it? Yeah, I could yeah. say. I've literally never for... seen a bee fly in a straight line. Oh, well, then, okay, as they the crow flies. kind of loop around drunkenly. All right, as the crow flies, I get that. Yeah, one. as the crow flies, yeah. Okay. <laughs> All right. Who are we missing here? I think we're. Uh, mine, because I got off track with that uh, lewd chat Oops. for a second. Mm -hmm. Um. You being distracted by lewd stuff? I am 
Yeah, I know, right? Super shocked this is the first timer. So, Arthur, I Googled that for you. Jesus, what do you mean? Oh, Make okay. a beeline for something in American English to move quickly and directly towards something. Very well, you got me. You know, Mary, uh, you you had something happen this past week as well, didn't you, Arthur? I forgot all about it. You know, you're talking about my Patreon. You got a loot chat in your Discord. That happened two weeks ago. And yeah, weeks I made the mistake been... of oh, popping wow. in there. <laughs> a major mistake. <laughs> Uh, and I've had to talk to several people about what they post in there. Oh, really? Yeah. Naughty, naughty. Yeah. It was really people, bad? Was people, it like, need, people need to chill the F out. Lolly stuff and things. Look, all I'm saying is, it's hard to look at people the same way when you know what they're <laughs> into in that kind of regard, okay? That's why I refuse to divulge any information of that sort. I wow. All oh, these these keywords are so on point tonight. Let's let's have the crowd take a look at them. Uh the first scene to Ooh, wow, I can't can't believe this. Look at that. Uh the first scene type is a heartwarming type. Who would like to be the scene player? Alright, it's Tama. Uh the Come keyword on. is curry. Ooh, curry. Uh, you know, it would have been really good if I'd had my rule books open, and I knew I forgot something tonight, and I swear to God, I'm getting worse at streaming every time I do this. Nah. nah. You're doing fine. Exactly. Terrible, terrible You're job. doing great. Doing great. We're doomed. <laughs> We're, doomed. We're doomed. We're definitely doomed. <laughs> but I think you're doing okay. It is the doom of man. All right. It's the one that has the missions in it. Nope, that's not it. Construction book two. There it is. All right. Firewarmings. Let's get the 2d6 dice. Meow, 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 meow. Seven. Perfectly average. <laughs> it's called Common Hobby. If you look at it this way, you can see the artistic sensibilities. Uh... <laughs> uh, it takes place at Mamias, uh, yeah, it does. and it's a curry making session. You get to pick a consort ship to escort you there and help you make some curry. <sighs> who's your Who's your escort ship today, Tama? Uh, I think it's gonna be you. Uh, you must pick another PC. Oh, I apologize. Yes. Uh, in that case, it'll be Sazanami. I was confused because you and you. Yeah, which which <laughs> you is that? <laughs> I was like, I first went with you. I didn't uh, know you you did that type of work. Sazanami. Give me the setup. Mommy is is here. She's got uh, her eyes wide open, and they've got starshine sparkles in it. And there's little shoujo manga flowers popping around her as she's watching the two of you in her kitchen. What kind of curry are you making? How are you doing it? Um, I think we're making some, like, pineapple curry. Like, where you, like, scoop out the pineapple, and you dice it up, and then you, uh, after you add the pineapple to the curry you serve it up in the in the pineapple shell oh damn that sounds yeah. good yeah uh and i think that uh sounds horrifying to me but i think tama is just like going through all of the steps of making stuff while talking about uh uh like gushing about torpedoes with sasanami like, I feel like Sasanami's not even really helping. She's just kind of there. I want... Sasanami is taking all the pineapple cuts that you make and turning them into little torpedoes. It's like shape, shaving yes. them off into torpedo shapes. Oh, yes. Extolling the virtues of oxygen torpedoes. Those are the cutest little torpedoes I ever saw. Sasanami, I can't wait to eat them, yeah? This was such a good idea. Is this your recipe? I don't know where I learned it, Meow. 
I just kind of endured it. Fair enough. <laughs> okay. Okay. I think Arthur's gonna cry here soon. <laughs> look. <laughs> Look, Bear fucking killed it in Lexi's chat just a second ago. <sighs> All right. What do you mean? Nothing. I mean uh, nothing. Swallowing bones? Yeah. How is that bad? I mean, I don't uh. swallow bones. Let's just get that straight. <laughs> but <laughs> how is he even saying that? How is like even the connotation of that bad? Uh huh. No, I didn't say bad. <laughs> I didn't. I'm not judging. Well, you see, now said, just don't. What is just it? Don't. No, I, I want to. I'm a, you know, I'm a knowledge seeker. What is Tama, that? it's a food <laughs> roll. Okay. Uh, great. Do you have food? No, I have catchphrase, optimistic hygiene, and animals. Where is food at? Animals is quite close. Animals. Okay, yeah, okay, that's not bad. It's a seven. It's a joke. Roll. Yes. You succeed. Oh, yeah. When you get a six on one die, you definitely succeed. <laughs> I uh, definitely got a seven. You may each learn a trait possessed by the other person, and it automatically oh. becomes a merit. Absolutely. Nice. I have a spot open. Okay. So you can learn Sazanami's traits, one of them. Uh, I'm going to learn torpedoes. My God. Nice. It worked out so perfectly. <laughs> How does shit like this happen? <laughs> Amazing. We're killing it up in here, fools. We're good at we're good at games. That's not how you spell torpedoes. Sid doesn't have an anime waifu yet. Do you, Sid? Do you have a waifu and I don't know about this? No. I feel like Nagato might be your waifu. You're very attached to her. No. <laughs> Like I said, I feel a kinship towards her, just like I feel a kinship towards M, and I feel a kinship towards Zero too. Doesn't mean I have a wife. Mm, no, he's just, right. He's, you know, he's right about that. No, at least I'm not, partially disturbed. I'm gonna let that one pass. Next this thing we know, so he gets a Dakimakura with <laughs> one of them. A what? Daki, Daki it's the Japanese body pillows with the full body image. On reverse yeah. sides. Mine's back there. Uh uh. It's like behind, like no. underneath everything. That's not even me. <laughs> <laughs> but they're so comfortable. And then my innocence with Scar was someone's like, you know, they do, you know, they use, use that for other things too, right? I was like, no. I thought it was just <laughs> cute, cuddly. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Uh. <gasps> Puppy! Talk about cute and cuddly. Hey, Kuma. Come back. <gasps> oh, that's what happened last episode, by the way. Rocky became a canon member of the cast. Oh, yeah, that was very important. Yeah, it was a pretty big deal. <laughs> was it? Yeah, Sid. Why, 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 why would you say that, Sid? Why would you say that? Literally everyone else agrees, and then you're just like, Kool-Aid man! Because oh, no. I secretly thrive on chaos. I don't know. <laughs> All right. Uh, it's an everyday scene type. Who would like to be the scene player? Wait. Uh, no, never mind. Okay. Every day, you said? Every never day. Mind. I can't be the scene player. That's I true. You can't. Player. You already went. I volunteer as tribute. Very well, Shokaku. Are you okay? Uh, the keyword is you with far, far too many U's. You. Yeah. Okay. I I just mean regular you. you. Now now I mean regular you. you. <laughs> I'm gonna get pinged for that for making that song reference. They were uh, on my I think we're like a you that soldier boy. Wow, that was like yeah. from high school. Word. Oh man. Fishing time. Uh, a big catch. Nice. Show her my rod. <laughs> uh, yeah, I'm gonna let that one pass. Uh, this is taking place at the training area. Uh, and it's a fishing trip out onto the islands where the training takes place. Who would like to attend? I'll go. 
Nyagato? Nyagato. Nyah, 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 I will be at the nyah, training nyah. grounds. Very well. So you'll be attending then, just to be clear. Oh, is that where that is? Yeah, training area. Yes. <laughs> I think I'll just be in the background, like, blowing up targets. Uh, so, all of you are out fishing when all of a sudden Shikaku finally gets a bite. Uh, and as she starts reeling it up, it is a very upset you being hauled up on the hook. And she's just looking at you like, why have you done this? I go, look, guys, I caught a lolly. <laughs> she, she looks at you and says, I was voted number one pet like lolly of Germany. I can understand why. You're so adorable. Hi, you. Hello. <laughs> Good and talk. Good and talk. I feel like she just kind of like brings her in and sets her down. <laughs> well, sorry. Okay, I'm... Yo? Like, how she get hooked? Did it hook into into her, or is it just like wrapped around something? Or uh, back of her uh, vest. Okay. You know, like where you'd pick a cat up between the shoulder blades. Ah, oh, makes sense. That makes sense. Uh, so you unhooks herself and then says, "You five one one diving," and then slowly starts lowering herself into the water. <laughs> just <laughs> keeps saying diving, diving, <laughs> blah, 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 until she gets beneath the water. And is like staring at you beneath the water, just beneath the surface. Oh, <laughs> I, I toss my 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 uh my hook back in. <laughs> what are the rest of you doing while this so is where you happening? You look at her and you just drop the hook right above her. <laughs> I'm glad she's okay, y'all. Should we like maybe dying. fish somewhere else so we don't hook her again, or...? Oh, that's a good idea, Nya. Harasami shows up, out. puts one arm around Sazanami and the other around Tom, and is like, Hey, what's up, guys? Sazanami, <laughs> Tama, it's me, Harasami arriving. Hey, you guys don't need to go anywhere else. Listen, if you can't avoid a hook, then I don't know how she's going to be flagship. That's really bad. Wow, that's kind of hurtful to say. I mean, a submarine I getting caught by a carrier? That's embarrassing. Unless she Ouch. wanted to get caught. Maybe she did. I mean, if you can dodge sure, a hook, you can that. dodge a torpedo. Yes, she, she's still, you know, looking at me. You think she's looking at my skirt? And she, like, holds it down. Arasami's just like, you're so lewd. You is a nice young lady. Nothing but polite. She's She's very lewd. She's really nice. <laughs> she's like, just like her face just drops. All right, uh, Shikaku, you need to make a composed check. That's personality three. Okay. Com composed personality three. Patient. Patient. I am. Yep, sorry, it's different in translation. Okay, I'm considerate, so that's pretty dang good. Yes, you need a six. A six. Okay, let's go. And away we go. No. Oh, man, this is bringing me back nightmares from our saga scene. <laughs> R.I.P. Gonna... Ruffles. Are you going to It's gonna Ruffle, it? but you know that. Yeah, I'm gonna rewrite. It, it, it's ruffles in my heart. It's ruffle, and he's he dead. He ruffled my heart. Right. Do ruffles have ridges? No, just stop. Oh, oh boy! Six energy. That is a crucial Ouch. blow. Holy cow! Good thing I have extra little extra energy now. All right. Nope, it's even worse. I know. Wow, wow that that literally, oh my God. literally is sagas. Oh my goodness! All right, nope, I'm done. I'm done. Wow. I want to say, by the way, Wait. since the last episode, we launched Saga of the Icelanders on Tuesday nights at 8 o'clock. Uh, you can watch it on YouTube. So, so, um, Lexi, do, do you have uh, your tears are delicious? I do not. I, I think okay. I'm building one for it. <sighs> and neither one of us have spent any energy yet, so. Oh, well. I have really bad news for you. As a result of your failure, you lose two more points of energy. And the Everybody? base loses... No, no, just the scene player. And the base loses two aviation fuel. 
Oh no. No. I wanted to develop. It's a, it is time to do development and such uh, for anyone that would like to do that. Development, resupply, refit, and discovery are all available. I would like to like, resupply or whatever. And I would refit. love to get a, another long range yes. gun. All right, so remember that we have multiple types of development now. You can do standard development or you can attempt to do the development tables up here. How, what do you have to do to do those development tables? Uh, underneath those development tables, it tells you how much each one costs. They have a different amount. Mm. Okay. Do we get a use use thing again? No. Uh, you can attempt Just... to acquire use thing by getting a five rating with her friendship. <laughs> Q, Q, Q? No, just, no. <laughs> I'm sorry. She's a little girl. Come on now. She's an old submarine. Um, I, I want to do gun and torpedo development. Very well. That sounds uh, like a good three, plan. 3663 and 4D6. You said 4D6? Yep. 16. The very average roll. On a 16, you develop a uh, 10 centimeter twin high angle gun mount. I think you already have one, right? Oh no, it's Sazanami that has one. But now there's a second one on the base. Okay, good to know. And the development area. It has AA. Yes, it does. Ooh, so it does. Um. Yeah, I'll, I'm gonna uh, swap out my medium caliber naval gun. Oh, is we that need one to write. Currently attached to. Yeah, that is currently attached to uh, animals. Not that I expect we'll ever use this again. I'm still working on getting more guests. Listen, there's been so many requests to have Henley back on the show again. Uh, everyone wants those abs really badly. But, <laughs> listen, they're thirsty for those abs. Apparently Big saying. Food Stuffs is probably super thirsty enough of what he posts now. Yeah. Uh, need some place to put all these guns. Cute, cute, cute. Really? That? <laughs> that? That is oh shit! All right, I gotta reverse time for a second. Everything's gonna reload and it's gonna be bad. I'm super worried. All right, did it work? It did. My bad. All right. What What did you do? I dropped the cards that have things written on them in the pile, which erases everything that's written on them. Oh. <laughs> I meant to only put them a little bit part way down just to start saving space because this place is full of shit. Uh... Okay, I have a problem. Yes, what is your problem? I can't zoom in on the table. That is a if problem. I get anything from maximum zoom, it unloads. I actually I have the same issue. Uh, okay, I'll you be might right. want to try uh, reloading. Yeah, I'm going to reload. My bad. I ruined everything. I just thought I'd let you know it's going to be a minute. Dai 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 just a little hiccup. Uh, did anyone else want to do development, resupply, refit? Uh, I definitely want to get my energy back. Uh, and then you're a carrier, so you probably want to use bauxite, right? Yep. Uh, you need six energy, which is three bauxite. Okay. All right. Yep. That's three box height. One. Uh, and I like. I like to develop. What would you like to attempt to develop? Uh, aircraft. Is that a thing I can do? Right. Yes, you can attempt aircraft development. It's three oh. six six six. Also, I need to use four box height because I have ten energy. Now. Okay. I think that should probably be up for the development for a little bit. Yep. I agree. I got some steel left. I only have one plane left, guys. Uh, 46. Let's see this roll. 46, you said? Yep. Okay, one, two, three, and four. Hopefully my rolls will be better than before. 
14. <laughs> On a 14, you develop a carrier-based torpedo bomber. Incredibly average fighter. Yep. Yep. Uh, dang. Probably not under the fun fighters. <laughs> One over here, where all the other people are. I want to go where the people are. Ah, yeah. All right. I want to go where the people go. Anybody else want to do stuff? Mm -hmm. Cotton, I, don't, can't, I can't trick you into doing some... Alright, that's too bad. <laughs> I was really hoping so. It's strategy time! I wonder who would be the lead player for this one, Sid Alpha. <laughs> Why, well, I'm sure I have no idea what you mean, but I'll take it. Somebody else should just jump in and steal it out from under him. <laughs> yeah, I've been waiting for that so badly. It would be amazing. Every time it's happened, I've already been a scene player when it comes up. Uh, the keyword is Harana. Yes. Yes. A three. Have we done this one before? Air support. Keep an eye out for enemy air patrols. Uh, this is taking place on the campus grounds. And Oyada is there. Who would like to attend? I'll go. I will stay behind. No ships left behind. Lukaku, will you attend the airstrike as the only <laughs> person who can actually equip aircraft? Yes, I will. Uh, sorry, uh, I was. Uh, you're Kuma. cooming. Kuma was being a puppy, or is being a puppy? So. It's it's okay. I understand. Doc I'm shocked to hear that a puppy was being a puppy. <laughs> He's so Completely cute though. Surprised. He doesn't run. He hops. It seems like it was like, put it, put it. <laughs> it's cute. Uh, so, I want you to take the image of Oyede in your mind, Sid. Uh, right here. Now take her rigging off. Give her a black bomber jacket uh, and giant dark sunglasses and two orange cone things for hand things. Uh, <laughs> and on her MP3 player, she's playing Danger Zone, and she's like chewing bubblegum and going, "All right, it's time for an air squadron attack. Nagato, you'll be directing the fighters. Go, go, go!" Actually, it'll take a few minutes for them to arrive. So, what's going on, guys? She pops her bubblegum. I think you get into this a little much. She's just like, Nagato. There's not much to do on this base here. You have to have fun sometime. This is true. You can't just act serious all the time. Just try hanging out with you. She's I a pretty cool girl. Like confused for a moment. <laughs> I'm sorry, hang out with who? You. The submarine girl? With Black her? Oh. 511, German, short, shortest person on base, wears all black, full body suit, water, underwater. Yes, I'm, I'm aware of... Hi. I'm aware of whom you, you speak. That's right. There's a lot to take care door. of. Door, come out. <laughs> and now you're nowhere near the door. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, you pumped that last time. All right, Sid. Uh, if no one else has anything to go, it's an aerial combat check, which is Warfare 4. Let's see. Oh, aerial it. combat. <coughs> do, do, do. Connection series, command, bold. Or supply. I think supply is going to be my closest one. One, two, three, four. That's a nine. Uh, yep. <clears throat> Show me your moves. That uh, is an eight. That's an eight. 
What do you want to do? What do you want to do? Remember the old days where you guys used to support each other on rolls before you saved them for battle damage? The blow the first time you shot at something? Well, also, um, it's like, save us from not dying now. Right, I'm going to re-roll it. Oh, boy. Oh, six! <laughs> Jesus Christ! Oh. <laughs> I got you now. You okay, Mary P? Yeah. Arthur's a sadist. Oh, shit, it's a seven. Gotcha again. Gotcha. I mean, do you want help? If you want help, you gotta ask. Uh, I'm not yeah. there. I guess I can't help you. <laughs> Never mind. You can't. I think you still can if you're not in the scene. I think Arthur did last week. Ah, yeah, if you want to call in or something. Uh, okay. Like we 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 can cut over to Tama. Like way like like uh. She's like sunning herself, but she has like um, binoculars, and she's like watching them over there, and uh, and she's like, "It's so cool seeing you do this, Nagato. I'm, I, I couldn't compete, but I love watching your style, Meow." How many points do you give Nagato? A billion. How uh, many points do you really give Nagato? Three. That is enough. That's uh, enough. Nagato, why don't you tell me how you command these aircraft fairies? What's going on here? Um, very tight, close-in formations. Um, layered, layered Vs to where they can break um, different sub squadrons and uh, groups can break off and still maintain a flying V formation even if multiple elements peel away. Yes. I read it in a book. All that training, you know. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Uh, your fairies are successful. During the next battle, treat all enemy ships airstrike uh, as if they were one point lower. Nice. People are getting to hear, I guess... Some of these people in chat haven't been around for long enough to have either seen me do it or talked about my old style where I printed off people's character sheets when they died, then I burned them and drank the ashes uh, so that I could keep their characters within me forever uh, and also gain their power. Hardcore. Yeah, you know, just like cutting like people's hearts out when they die. I mean, I mean, that sounds like, you know, uh, a, a witchy ritual to me. I'm just saying. It's called a warlock ritual where I'm from, okay? I'm sorry, I'm sorry. We offer a dark bargain with the elder gods and they give us a weapon in, in response. Mine is a quill. It's not very and useful. And you wield it well. Uh, the final scene type is a heartwarming scene. Zazanami, I think you're our last. That's me. Uh, and the keyword is you. <laughs> because we've already done a heartwarming scene, unfortunately you get a minus one on this roll. Let's see what we end up getting. Wasn't there already a heartwarming scene with you? You? Uh, no, it was a oh, different no. keyword. It was curry. There was a heart of an everyday scene with you. With you, yep. All right, so years. instead of a seven, it's a six. You are in a boring meeting. Uh... Uh, you are in a meeting with you uh, and the Admiral in the Admiral's office. Uh, and the Admiral is just going like, all right, let's go over the reports for today. Now, from what I understand, we're getting newly updated communication codes, and I'll need to be going over all of them with you. But first, we've got OSHA compliance notices that I'll be posting around the base. We're going to do a quick OSHA reminder so with you here we're going to need to update where all the wet areas are while this is going on you is continuously passing your letters so it's just like hey what's up and then like five seconds later like another text message you has <laughs> drawn a picture of her face uh and and like a text box inside of these little slips of paper and then then like written in how do i spend more time with nagato and then five seconds later you get another one that's like nagato is so cool I respond, Nagato is the best. 
Agreed. We should both spend more time with Nagato. Uh, she writes on the paper, hashtag spending time with Nagato. I draw a little chibi version of the three of us holding hands. Send it back to her. You sends you back a message. It takes her longer than five seconds, but she's like, we have a very different relationship with Nagato, but yours is very wholesome. Wait, what's yours? <laughs> so who's your second favorite ship girl? <laughs> It's the next message. <laughs> um, Haruna. <laughs> Just picking all the NPCs, huh? All right, you have to pick another player character to join in on this messaging. Oh, uh, let's go with Tama. All right, Tama. Let's so uh, think Nagato, and I'm like walking down the sidewalk, and my my phone goes bling. Oh, I should have picked. I should have picked what? Nagato. <laughs> Tama, you begins dumping uh, these text message, literal pieces of text with text messages on them, on your dash, just like. Yeah, uh, obviously I have to respond as well. But instead of instead of like Tama drawing a picture of like herself in the box, it's a picture. Uh, uh, it's a picture of a cat, um, and just like one of the generic black cats that are around. One of the eight black cats. Yeah, the black cat family. I know them well. Uh, yeah, and then so she starts getting in on the on the, you know, Nagato is so dreamy. Uh, bandwagon <laughs> as as my relationship with Nagato is the vapors uh, you sends back a message to both of you saying should we start the unofficial Nagato appreciation club yes I just send it back in all caps I actually send three of them uh, <laughs> uh, I, I send it I, I send back haven't we already and then there's like a, a little, a uh, uh, little, you know, like smirky cat face in, you know what I mean? Yeah, no, I know what you mean. <laughs> uh, Zazanami, you need to make a ciphers check as the Admiral turns around and is like, what are you girls doing over there? She begins approaching at high speed. I have enemy awareness. Uh, enemy awareness will give you a seven. Good luck. Show me your move. New Star Fox game, by the way. A seven. seven, exactly what you need. Uh, while this is happening, you flips all the text messages over, and she's written notes on the other side of it related to the meeting in German. Uh, and the Admiral's just like, oh, good work, you. Uh, excellent note taking. Ne next time, just talk to your other teammates if you need to catch up with them. Okay. All right. <laughs> so, as a result, uh, Sazanami and Tama can uncheck all of their support boxes. My only support box was with Nagato. Well, congratulations. Got it. Congratulations. Back. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. All right, let's take our uh, our cards back. Did anyone want to do any development, resupply, refit, or discovery? Oh, sorry, I mean, I this is the to resupply. This is the wrong one. We can't. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're right. <laughs> uh, so Arana places out the face of your enemy for the next fight. Oh, God. Uh, Harna says, <clears throat> four elites in a flagship? We can do it. What the shit? It's, it's not that I'm... Oh, sorry, she wouldn't say I. It's not that Harna is underestimating the destroyer, but it is the most basic class of destroyer. It looks like they've started experimenting with improving their weakest ships first. Harna has been noticing this. Now... What you really need to be worried about is sonar. Harana's been tracking their approach, and it looks like both the submarine 
and the Destroyer are capable of stealth attacks. Karna is very worried about this. Uh, stealth you attacks. So what, what do you mean stealth attacks? That doesn't sound good, Meow. Uh, what I mean is, I'm saying out of character that they have both have Sniper of the Sea, which means that they get to attack during the torpedo round before anyone does anything, including aerial oh, combat. Shit. Yep. And since they don't have to roll, they literally just go dunk on all of you. That's really bad. Yeah, it is bad. Oh, wow. uh, the good news is, is that while during that torpedo round, they don't get to attack everybody, they have to specifically attack targets, just like any torpedo round would go. But yeah, it's not super great. <laughs> uh, instead, Harana says in gibberish uh, about uh, oxygen torpedoes, long-range stealth attacks, sonar, blah, 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 until all of you understand what she's talking about. Now, this is a very important mission. Harna wants to make sure that you understand. If you can complete this enemy fleet and knock them out of the way, we'll finally be able to get a refueling point to take down SS Island. Taking down SS Island is our major fleet objective. If you do your best here, we might be able to take down more princesses. And as you know, that might mean we might be able to get more fleet girls. <laughs> I always do my best, Nyao. I know Nagato will too, Nyao. Arana pats you on the head three times. <laughs> Any uh, questions? <clears throat> Destroy them all. Come home alive. Sounds pretty straightforward. Hmm. All right then. Okay, so let's uh, let's switch over to battle mode. Uh, can we use the furniture first before we go yes. to battle? Yes, you can. I was just thinking that... Um, Everybody's like, like furniture? Let's put our markers over that. The. Uh, <laughs> I want to know how furniture works. The low dining table set might be good since we do have ammo and we could... Uh, I know Sasanami has the food check. So you yeah. get, uh, get Nagato back up with her energy. Yep, that's what I was planning on doing. Oh. <laughs> This is never gonna wear cat ears, guys. Don't even ask. You said no a hundred times. Oh, yeah, someone just asked my chat, why is Sid not wearing cat ears? I I'll wear my cat ears next time. Yeah. Next episode, it'll happen. Yeah. Because I'm far too grumpy and Meow. I'm no fun. Meow. That's why. Meow. <laughs> Meow. Meow. You know, you could be, you could just be grumpy cat. You know. Why don't you get dog ears, grumpy, dog? You could be grumpy cat, right? I mean, that'd be your, I guess, your, your spirit Wolf ears, animal. Badger ears. <laughs> you could get bunny rabbit ears. No. Uh, so let's go ahead and make this food You can check. get bunny rabbit ears. <laughs> Suzanami, how many PCs would you like to feed at the dining table? Just, just Nagato. I think everybody else is fine. Uh, so you have to feed yourself and Nagato. I'll feed myself, I guess. All right. And Nagato. So... You have all your energy, so you just like walk out like. Mm. <laughs> uh, you have food, right? Mm -hmm. All right, make your check. You need a five. That's you got five. exactly five. Uh, you Ooh. both regain one d six energy. So I feel like the two right. of you are in the briefing room, and Oyeda oh, like comes in and sets down this low dining table, and like two um. Uh, futons in front of both of you and begin setting out like rice and curry and then opening up some anno canisters and pouring gunpowder as a seasoning over both of them <laughs> Oida comes over to Nagato and whispers in her ear it's okay I know that you don't like spicy curry that's why this is extra sweet I just nod at her silently very grateful <laughs> Oida des. Uh, how much energy did you regain at Nagato? Uh, four. Did you guys want to use any other furniture? Yes. Uh, I wanted to use the Teru Teru Bazu dolls. Uh, the trait is listed as sadistic, and I want to make sure that I'm... It's cruel. It's cruel. Okay. So I have, uh, optimistic, so I need a seven if I'm... Yeah? Yep. Uh, that 
didn't reading it. That shows as an eleven. Either I'll an eleven or a twelve. It's not going to matter. I'll take it. Uh, if the battle I mean, if it's twelve, uh, I don't think actually it has to be on a special. Never mind. Uh, if it's disadvantageous, you may change the battlefield to your choice once per session. Okay. Mm -hmm. Congratulations. Anybody else? You go hang some dolls up upside down. Creepy. Yeah, they are pretty creepy. Um, I want to make a serious check for the Fleet Girl's personal desk. All right, spend two points of energy. Made it. Very well. Got it. No, note that's once per session, so you can't do this again. Yeah. Okay. Can other people do it? But yes. Okay. All right then. Uh, let us all have each of you go to your secret dice and choose your formation, uh, and then we'll do reconnaissance between the fleet. The enemy fleet does not have reconnaissance capabilities. However, it does have anti-aircraft ability. Mm -hmm. uh, your fleet, would you like to recon? Uh, yes, please. Two, uh, one reconnaissance plane. Your carrier-based torpedo bomber? Yep. All right, so you start by making a uh, awareness check. Yep. Detection Naval 4, which is enemy awareness. Yep, I have uh, aerial combat. So that's a seven. seven. Yep. No. No. Am I, am I, am I, no, I don't. No, well. I don't. Uh, All right. You send your recon plane out. It gets forced back by enemy fire. Uh, uh, for the first time in a long time, your pilots are encountering enemy flak. Uh, and they report that the submarine surfaced very temporarily in order to fire the flak off before diving again. I just kind of give them a salute as they slip back into my quiver. Uh, so, let us reveal our locations then. Show me your... Okay. I'm in position six. I am in four. I am also in four. Come on, hit me. You want oh to be no, hit? the cap little ship is in five. I Are mean, you? I am designated damage taker. Are you all in four? Holy cow. Holy I feel cow. really bad oh, for this guy right here. He's, he's got some <laughs> trouble incoming. <laughs> Uh, you better prepare for double. All right, so... Uh, wait, 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 wait. I was yeah. muted. Uh, I have guidance, which says, we, um, I may use this ability when revealing the formation. Choose one allied ship in the same position as you. Make a check using the link trait with withdrawal. <laughs> and if it's successful, I may choose that, change that ship's position by one. So... Yeah, well. Please uh, I am five. Going to, that is exactly what I'm planning on doing. Your withdrawal you. check. So I no longer have withdrawal, so I'm going to be rolling torpedoes. So I need a seven. Very well. Show Whoa. me your power. That's a six. Uh, All right, I'm going to re-roll that. I see. Five. Uh, That's you okay. You guys are rolling really high in the energy drain today. I got lots of energy. It's fine like me eating pancakes she's that's okay i i have plenty no. of tears to feed her so it's even worse no. it's even worse i mean i'm gonna re-roll it i'm gonna re-roll it the sid alpha strike is real right here <laughs> oh no this is wow. so bad wow Four, five, six. i love uh, the idea that it's you trying to push nagato and nagato's like i'm fine where i'm at and you're like no there yeah. we go yeah nope. i know that's a six that's still a Fuck. six I, I can't re-roll it again. Let's see. Uh, da, 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 I mean, da, da. do you want to help me? Do you want to help me help you? Yes. I will I will, I will will aid you in this endeavor. Okay, well. Damn it. You managed to push uh, Nagato one space. Which way did you want Nagato to go? I'm going to five. I, I, I mean, whoa, whoa. You don't get to choose, Sid. She gets I to choose. I did it. I chose. That's where I wanted Nagato to go. It's also where Nagato wanted to go. Uh, well, Nagato, it's time for your round of total hell death to begin. 
As the enemy flagship opens fire on you with its torpedoes, uh, it is a 5 oh, gonna 6 hurt. They're 21 inch late model torpedoes. Wait, 5d6? I can't do anything about this. Nope. Nothing at all. Nope. Welcome to Nothing. fighting flagships. They're really, really tough. Uh, uh Jesus, it's a 13. One That's hit. Terrible nice. Roll. I was awful, lucky. Awful, awful roll. Uh, you also get opened up on by the so class submarine in submerged position. Uh, and their torpedo launch capability is 46. Uh, and you take a. That's another point. hit. Yeah, I mean, as the battle begins, you're sailing into position. <laughs> Tama pushes you, God and you damn. end up parallel with the enemy flagship, and then all of a sudden, out of nowhere, explosions rack the area around Nagato. She's completely surrounded by a cyclone of water, and when it comes out, uh, her clothing is damaged, and she's taken some very serious hits, and she has minus one to all action checks. Mm. Uh. All right, next up, uh, aerial combat. Would you like to participate in aerial combat? Uh, yes, I would. Right. Uh, I want to use my Suisei and my carrier based repeater bombers. Excellent. Uh, the left hand one is the Suisei. 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 Nagato is in the Marilyn Monroe pose. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, one and five. And one. Uh, the carrier paste torpedo bombers can target anything in the five range. Like okay. the uh, elite destroyer or the flagship destroyer. Uh, I'm trying to the elite destroyer. I mean the the flagship. Sorry. Excitement. All one. right. Uh, that's two d six. Whoops. Wow, wrecked. But that's an eleven. Yep. Uh, but the flagship has an armor rating of 10! That's yes. a hit. Uh, your little fairies go out, and they, they start messaging you back, and they're like, hit, we've got a hit! Uh, do a barrel roll! And you hear the other <laughs> one just like, I'm doing it, I'm doing it! And then the second one's just like, you, you, use bombs wisely! And then you hear like a <laughs> in the background, uh, and Nagato reports back a successful hit. a tiny hit. little, butt <laughs> <laughs> uh, you hold out your your shield and your planes begin landing. Yeah, that, does, that, that image does look pretty cool. Just kind of point out. Uh, we start in the extreme shelling phase with Shukaku. Okay. Do um, you want to use your ability to up your armor? Mm, I'm not into much. Uh, I'm not really in danger right now. Uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna hold off actually for sh machine range. Okay. Uh, yep. Sid, do you have an extreme range weapon yet? No, I'm all long and medium. Very well, long range. <laughs> uh, really? <laughs> really? All right, Nagato, long range. Would you like to fire? Yes, I would. Very well. <laughs> Use your target. All right. Uh, target is the capital ship. I'm going to try and uh, concentrate fire. Okay. That yes. is a yes. All right. So we'll start off with my 41 centimeter twin gun mount. All right. If I, uh, oh, you're firing on the flagship? Yes. You need a seven. That's seven. Uh, uh, that is a hit. All right. Whoa, so I need a nine for my second shot? Yes. It's a flagship. Welcome to the real life. Come on, it's just a little destroyer. I'm going to whip out my personal desk. <laughs> this roll is now a 10. Very well. Which means it also activates the power of the big seven. It does. So that's uh, four, seven, that's 11 D6 that I'm going to be rolling here. Unless anyone would like to aid me in this endeavor of horribly murdering this capital ship. Can we see? What, I want to see what you roll first. Three, four, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ah, uh, you have 11. a minus one on your roll. 
from your damage from before. <gasps> oh no! Which means your first shot wouldn't hit. Uh, I motherfucker. I, I thought it would hit, so. Would it have hit? Yeah, you still need like a, a seven. All right. No, that's okay. I'll reroll. That's what he rolled roll was it. a seven. Yeah, yeah. I'll reroll re -roll it. Okay. Okay, so roll for the energy. It's a minus three, so mm -hmm. I lose one energy. Oh, you're going to activate your honor of the flagship ability? Mm hmm. All right, you can't do that again. Nope, that was a horrible roll. Can't do that again. Uh, all right. Right, I'll... honor of the flagship's only one. Five right? energy. Honor of the flagship. No. Uh. No, actually, you can reroll it. All right, my bad. So that's, I get three energy back then. Mm -hmm. All right. Roll it again. Well, that worked. Ten. Very well. How's that? So we're back to where we were before. 11 C6. Yep. Ah. Come your moves. All right, make sure that's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. I mean, that's 10, showing 11, 52 12, right now, so you 1, could conceivably 2, 3, do a lot of damage. 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, Will 10, you sit 11, off a 12. strike? That's. You jinxed nah. him. 13. That's uh, too many dice. Here we go. All right, here we go. Uh, that's 35. Say goodnight. That is instant destruction. See, I knew I didn't need to help you. At the very least, at least I got to snipe you with a 5d6 torpedo, and that's all I got to do. Bastard. <laughs> that hurts. Uh, I don't lot. think Sazanami or Tama have a long range, correct? Very well. Medium range. Uh... I have medium range. Yeah, you already went. Stop trying to go again. This isn't a carousel. Oh. Oh. Tama, Sazanami. Medium range? I'm holding out to short range. Very well. Holding out for a hero. Shikaku. You know, I'll actually fire uh, my... Um, on the... Oh uh, destroyer. Shooting. First time in three episodes. I, I actually, mean, uh, when it comes around, there's I've three destroyers there. Three, three destroyers there. So, yeah, I want to do um, a, a no in uh, position three. Oh. Somebody just steal my destroyer. I guess you did. I'm so sorry. I didn't mean to do that. Why would you do that? <laughs> Fine, <that's... laughs> Fine, I can just make a new one. I just don't know why you picked it up and threw it across the map. The guy's like, no, I don't like this one. I was just looking at it, and then it kind of blew away. All right. I don't know what happened. I'm so sorry. Okay. Uh, which aircraft are you firing first? Uh, I'm going to do my carrier based torpedo bombers. Okay. Five. Yes. A six. Five. All right. And then this we say. All right. Seven. Seven. Successful. Seven. Yeah. You drop to one knee as you're going around, using your shield to block for you. As you fire off wave after wave of fighters, uh, this destroyer peeks out of the water and goes and turns towards you as it sees this huge incoming wave of aircraft that have sprouted from your arrows uh, that begin opening gunfire and torpedoes all over it. And it's like, Let's see what kind of damage you can do. Sorry, I'm trying to sound like a sick velociraptor. I don't know if that's coming out over very well. 23? 23. Uh, it has an armor rating of six, which means that's three hits. Ah, uh, one plane off. Okay. I mean, I don't want to throw supports. a support of five against that when we need one point. Okay. I agree. All right. Uh, it weathers it just barely, managing to survive. Next up <laughs> is I Class Destroyer, who must fire on Nagato. I have a feeling this is going to hurt. That's what she said? I'm sorry. Uh, it just... It drifts for a moment and moves sideways, but it's propelling. It's still forward, so it's literally drifting like a car. Uh, opens its mouth as it screeches, and its five-inch gun comes out and begins firing a chain of shots at Nagato. Uh... It is uh, shelling warfare seven. Uh, let's see. 
Let's see, connections, serious supply is going to be my closest. Uh, so I need an eight. <clears throat> Actually, I need a nine because of the plus one from damage, right? Yes. Ah, oh, that's uh, that's a no. Uh, I have nothing to boost that with. So with a firepower rating of two and a gun rating of two, that's forty-six. Uh, I failed, so take an energy. I desperately needed that. Thank you for reminding me. Uh, in the end, the roll is a 15, which is another hit. Yep. Nagato takes hit after hit, beginning to sink into the water. You now have a minus two heavy oh. damage. <clears throat> uh, wait, wait, how much did, she, did he take? 15 point hit. Um, I will substitute myself for that. Very well. I'll take a hit. Tell me about this. What does it look like? Um, I feel like Shukaku skiing over the um, over the the water towards Nagato as she sees the uh, destroyer coming towards her. Uh, the um, ships are returning to her uh, to her shield, so she's like holding it out while she's running. The dots real fast, and she kind of does a little dive roll in the way and like holds her shield up, takes the hit. Is it like a Dark Souls dive roll? Uh, it's, it's like a cooler. <laughs> you come up and you praise the sun. <laughs> No, it's, like, it's kind of like uh, it's more control. Like you know, she kind of tucks in. Just does and then, the like, T stance right in front of him. <laughs> <laughs> Her animation <laughs> gets long. <laughs> no, she's she's definitely she's crashing in the water, you know, and holding it up like that. Yeah. All right. Instead, Shikaku takes the hit for you, Nagato. Uh, and I use one point of energy for that. Oh, it probably happens in slow motion too, and like a splatter of blood from her splashes on you, on top of all of the seawater. I want to make yeah, it super the sad. Spray. Wow. I made Nagato wet. <laughs> wow. Uh, <laughs> turning to the adults, Thomas Azanami, what do you want to do? Do you want to go first or do you want me to go first? <laughs> I'll do it. I'll do it. Actually, no. Mm, yeah, I'll do it. Okay. <laughs> Uh, so I'm going to shoot first with my um, 61 centimeter quad O2 torpedoes. Um, okay. oh. uh, that's a horrible that's a four. Roll. No, no, I get it. You have accuracy. I have accuracy of two. That's true. Oh, thank God. <laughs> thank goodness I have accuracy. Okay. Uh, I'm going to push my luck. Of course I am. Mm -hmm. uh, next, I'm going to shoot my 20.3 uh, centimeter twin gun mounts. Okay, so that is... That's a seven. Uh, five plus two is seven. That's enough. And uh, I'm going to call it there. Um, instead of uh, pushing a little further. All right, tell me what this I, looks I like. Don't, I do not have the energy if I mess up, and I would much prefer to to get this right. So, so Thomas skates out uh, ahead of Sazanami, and uh, like, bloop, 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 the torpedoes drop into the water, and then they start like spreading out ahead of her, uh, and then she comes around, uh, like she loops back around because the twin mount guns are like longer range. Uh, and then just start shooting oh, like they're shooting off of her shoulder at it as she kind of stripes a big circle and then the uh, torpedoes come in and hit at once oh, I, I love the idea of you sailing sideways like circle strafing this thing oh yeah totally improbably <laughs> yeah exactly. like move your <laughs> you have to twist your whole upper body so you can sail in the correct direction it's like mech warrior you got yeah exactly like that all right so i get uh i get six dice yep one three four five one one three 18. four well i got some of them right uh 18 uh with an armor rating of six that's three hits looks like it's sazanami's cleanup time unless someone wants to give me uh to support me so we or can get that out of the submarine. way i already I already used my support uh, I might see. Yeah, I'll support Thomas. 
Very All well. Right. What's your support rating? Uh, two. Is that enough? It's probably. You need to deal six points of damage on 2d6, which you do. That's six points right there. Uh, how do you support? Uh, I feel like uh, I look across the field and see uh, Tama shooting at that, so I'm so crouched and pulled some arrows out, like three of them, and just, you know, to put them all at the same time, shoot them out. Okay. Hopefully you're at least so holding you, the bow sideways when you yes, do that. So sideways. she does the Robin Hood men in tights where she takes one and then just unfolds a whole quiver <laughs> of arrows. <laughs> exactly, exactly. I mean, they turn to planes anyway, so, you know, it doesn't have to actually be super accurate. Oh, but it does. It does. That's why Akagi and Kaga practice every day for hours. Oh, wow. <laughs> you fire them out. Two sets of the plane just go flying sideways, and they're all like <laughs> drifting drunkenly across the battlefield. <laughs> it distracts them long enough to get wrecked. Uh, Sazanami, it's time for the Sazanami cleanup crew. Will the tsunami be active today? Who knows? <laughs> Probably yes. What's your target? The submarine. I see. Well, I'd rather you didn't target that one, uh, but go ahead. <laughs> what will you shoot with first? My torpedoes. Of course. Those ones are my favorite. Well, you have two sets of them to know how favorite they are. Yeah, that'll yes. play. I'll you want to keep firing? Other, my other torpedoes as well. Other, other torpedoes? My other, other torpedoes. Uh, uh five, what's I your accuracy? So you're fine. Success. Very well. Uh, firepower five. rating is zero. I've got oh, one. one. I've got one. Uh, you have five d six then. Mm -hmm. it's super hard to see these die faces. There we go. Sorry. Nineteen. Eleven. Nineteen. Oh, I missed one. Submarine has a armor rating of nine, uh, which means two it takes hits. two hits. Right, bad guy's turn. Uh, this one is unblocked, and so we'll rampage and target all of you. Oh, goody. Uh, this makes me so happy. So this particular does. one uh, does the same thing that happens in Gurren Lagann, where it just starts growing extra sets of guns, uh, and then sits still and begins firing in every direction as it's consumed by gun smoke. All of you need to make a shelling Warfare 7 check. I have withdrawal. I need a five. So I need to hit a nine to make this. I got torpedoes. Boom. Ten. I did not make it. There's my rolls. Taking energy. I'm going to get and shot. Eight. All right. I'll take that energy. I'm going to roll my two dice here. Totally <laughs> got it. Yeah, it's That's death blossoming. It's Reaper just showed up. Yeah. <laughs> uh, I'm sorry, so who got shot? I did. And that's it? Yeah, sounds what like. Did you, what did you roll, Sid? Seven. What did you need? Uh, nine. I'll assist you so you don't get shot. Cool, so I don't get shot. That does sound like a good plan. I, I do enjoy not getting shot. You it's, do. You do have it's quite one a bit of my, uh, my most fond states of being is not being shot. However, it's now the submarine's turn, uh, and the submarine is going to shoot Nagato. Is that short range, or is this? Uh... It's still short range. Yeah. Uh, it is a withdrawal check for Nagato. Uh, withdrawal. So one, two, three, four. Fucking god! Wait. Two, three, four. Same equidistant, of course, you between command it. and supply. So I have to roll a ten. And there's minus two to it because of your damage. No, minus one. You Remember, minus she two. took the hit, so I'm not at three damage. I'm at two. That's true. You're right. Yeah. You can do it. Right. So it's what eleven then? No, it's ten. Okay. All it right. would be nine. If we, it would be all nine right. if I didn't have any damage. All right. Calm down, chat. We're getting there. 
Ten. What the fuck? Yes. What the fuck? <laughs> Fight on. <laughs> Fight on. Ha <laughs> <laughs> ha. Suck it, submarine. <laughs> Uh, so yeah, briefly surfacing like over her torpedo. <laughs> the horrifying woman stuck inside of a gunboat with giant teeth thing shows up and like a wave of torpedoes come at Nagato, who begins like horse stepping over them as they pass right underneath her feet, uh, jumping with all of her might. Uh, end of the Never round. Appreciated how heavy these guns are. <laughs> Flagship, would you like to withdraw? Hell no. All right. Chikaku, we are at short range. What would yep, you like I'll to go do? ahead and finish off that um, Elite I Class Destroyer. Very well. Uh, and I'm going to start with my Swoo State. Here's a five. Let's see, what's their armor rating? A six? Okay. Five. Uh, do you have an accuracy? I do not. That is a miss. I reroll. Very well. Two. Mm -hmm. Ooh, that, was, that was really close to me. Mm -hmm. A six. Nope. Oh my god. Miss again. Oh my again. Wait, you needed a five, right? A yes, but it has it has an accuracy rating of two. So it cancels oh. out. It has an evasion rating of two. Six energy? Yeah, oh, my goodness. goodness. I kill something. Something. Oh, oh, son of a bitch. And Is this your a... second gun or your first one? That's actually a hit if you have an accuracy rating of one. I do not. Well, then you miss. What is a... Uh... Universe is telling me by that one. Uh, I am the... Is this your first port... gun or your second? First. Um, first. The universe is saying that you are a support carrier. What are you trying to do? Did we get to the end of the thing? The yeah. end of the first round? Yes. Can I move? Yes. You have to make your check. I don't want any roll for that check, actually. <laughs> you don't want... <laughs> okay. <laughs> uh, is anyone supporting Shikaku? Or will this check go down in history as a miss? It's okay. I think it's a miss. I think we can still take it one out. I mean, Very I think well. it's fine if it's a miss, plus I get an energy. I feel like Shikaku is still trying to fire crossbow style, <laughs> no, and the, the fairies are just like, the fairies pop out, and then the planes like veer off, and you're just getting told off on local communications. They're like, this is not going to work at all. Please just stop, and you're like firing wave after wave. Now there's like dozens of planes in the air, and they're all flying in circles. Uh, trying not to crash into each like, other. You hear me come over the comms as I'm zeroing in on my destroyer. I'm like, stop trying to fire gangster style. It's not going to work. Listen, my uh, <laughs> my um, my tracking device or whatever. She's like trying to go for the kill shot. <laughs> uh, did you roll for that, Cotton? I did, and then I failed once and lost five energy, and then I rolled again. Oh boy. That's All us. this energy being just burned away. Speaking of energy getting burned away, let's talk to Sid Alpha Exercise Master. I do yeah, have a let, question, let's... though. Yes. Since that was happening at the same time, do I get any point for her failure? Yes. Ooh. No, wait. No. Okay. Because you had to do that before her failure. Because it happens in between the yeah. rounds. That's right. Okay, yes. my... Yep. Well, I mean, if she gets wait. a point after, though. That's yeah, true. Wait, yep, you're correct. Yeah, 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 you're right. You're right. First in, last out. You are technically correct. Uh, let's talk about Nagato. What do you want to do? Fire at the target directly ahead of you? Your yes, only I would love option. to fire at the target directly ahead of me. Very that well. Would be beautiful. It's a six to hit. <sighs> well, no. fuck my life. <laughs> let's see. Should I reroll? I'm trying to reroll. Very well. That's your choice. That's your All right. Brother. So that gets decreased to one energy. <sighs> That's a zero. You want to reroll again? Yes, I do. Very well. That's one another energy. one energy. 
That was a dangerous game for you. That is a hit. Uh, seven. Jesus Christ. <laughs> you get the six that you need. Uh, let's see. Uh, this thing's undamaged, isn't it? That's correct. I'm going to have to try and push my luck here. Really? Do you feel like that's a wise choice? That's uh, That was a terrible choice. I missed. Yeah. <laughs> How much did you miss by? A lot. Uh, I missed by four. Dang it, I could only give you three. Wait, I, uh, no, three. Uh, I, I give a minus you. one. So eight. We do have a second battle. I know. Okay. So you're giving me the three? It is a decisive battle. If that'll too. make the difference, yes. Um, that'll make it hit. Yes. Yeah. yeah. Very well. All right. Tell me how uh, this yeah. how this goes down. How do you help? What is Nagato firing? How's this going down? I'm firing, uh, of course, my uh, 41 centimeter twin gun mountain large caliber naval gun. For big boys. So uh, I think that Tama um, skates closer uh, since we're just a lane away. And uh, uh, it's like, uh, probably it's it, it's torpedoes. Uh, just like kind of like plunk out and like they go towards the target and then she skates back. Like, no big deal. 26. Instant sink. Yes. Two shots, two kills. Damn it. Just can't let me have any nice things, huh? Very well. It would have been the enemy's hey, turn, but now it's not. I'm and bleeding right now, so. <laughs> but that's normal for you, Sid. That's true. It doesn't matter what show it and is. And I'm still extremely terrible at rolling dice. <laughs> yeah, that's also you, Sid. Uh, Tama, you're up. Okay, yeah. Uh, I'm gonna Oh, gosh. Shoot I love that. the idea... Wait, wait. I love the idea that you help out Nagato and the camera just keeps following you onto your turn. Yeah, yeah perfect. Uh, so I'm gonna now help out Sazaname and I'm gonna shoot at the one in uh, spot three. Very well. I'm actually gonna and... interfere in this roll. <gasps> okay. I'm gonna block your ones. I didn't need my ones anyway. Uh, so I'm gonna start off with my torpedoes. That's an eight. Yeah, Plenty. You me ones. Yeah, that's good. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna keep pressing on my twin gun mounts. Okay, that's so two a... gets canceled. Huh? What's that? Two gets canceled. Oh, you still made it. The twos, but I still make it because I've got plus It has an evasion rating of two, so I don't need to cancel that out. Uh, it just happens. Uh, you have an accuracy of two. Fucking yeah. son of a... Yeah. Fine. They <laughs> hit. Okay. Uh, and yeah, I'm going to go ahead and uh, push for the last one. Uh, my um, twin high angle mount. He's at like three hits. Is he at three Six. hits? Yep. Yeah. That two gets canceled. Uh, so that's six, not, not enough. enough. Six, I'm gonna have to roll. Uh, three short. Uh, someone wanna? Someone wanna? I don't have any support. Otherwise, I would. I wouldn't be enough, anyways. Ah, uh, not that's always enough. Um, now I'm saving my. Well, I actually just support you, but we also do have a decisive battle coming up after. All right. You. Um. I can't risk it. If I uh, if I roll a six, I, I knock myself out. It's not worth it. All right. You end up missing. You try so hard. You throw everything you got into the battle, and at the last second, uh, firing that extra wave of torpedoes trips you up. All of the torpedoes end up missing, and all of your gunfire uh, is anticipated. Which brings us to Sazanami. You have two targets. Who would you like to go for? Oh, that's right. I can always shoot at the sub. Yes. I'm going to shoot sub. Very well. That's your prerogative. I'm probably going to cancel something out. Give me a second here. I got a ton of energy. I'm going to cancel your threes. Okay. I rolled an eight and I have an act two, two. Uh, well, fuck. But I'm going to press my luck and roll one more time. Yes. Excellent. Do that. I rolled a 10. That's, I rolled two fast. That's a 12. 
so. Fine. Do you want to fire a third gun? No. <laughs> Fine. Fire your <laughs> torpedoes. Fire the torpedoes. My torpedoes. You're missing one. Five. Uh, five. Uh, no, no, you're right. Five, five, five. Seventeen. With an armor rating of nine, that is one hit. Sazen, I'm going to support you with two more dice. Very well. That automatically succeeds. But how do you do it? I think that uh. I think uh, as, as she's, like, skating by me, I, like, kick one of her torpedo tubes and an extra one just kind of goes thunk out. <laughs> That's... I feel like both you and Nagato have no idea how fairies work. Uh, so I'm just going to leave it at that. I... <laughs> uh, okay. While you're distracted firing off your wave of torpedoes, Surfacing next to you, the I class comes out and is just like, uh, and fires a barrage directly at you. Make your dodge. Your dodge type is shelling, Warfare 7. Which I have enemy around as my 5 and 6 is closed. Uh, 1, 2, 3, 4. That is uh, with your evasion of 2, a 7. Don't you have torpedoes? Isn't that closer? Is it closer? Two, three. Yeah. Yes. Uh, however, that will still fail. Yeah. I will roll it. Very well. Three energy. Did you, you remember need... to get the energy from me missing earlier? No. She take energy. Six on the die. Eight. Uh, that will do it. I also get an energy for dodging. That's right, because you you have guts and you're a destroyer. <laughs> so you get one for her miss and your dodge. Yep. Uh, nice. We find ourselves at the end of the round and enter the torpedo phase. Kill it. Uh, Tama, I believe you're first. Yeah, I'm going to shoot some torpedoes. Uh, which torpedo tube would you like to launch from? I only have one torpedo tube. Who's your target? Uh, there's only one target. Make your check of torpedoes. Okay. <laughs> I have torpedoes now. Uh, so nine succeeds. That is successful. Uh, you roll three Three. to six. Boop. Nine. Uh, number nine. With an armor rating of a six, that is destroyed. Yeah. Na, na, na. All right, you clean up and completely wipe out the enemy forces. Do what? you want to roll on the regular spools of war or the special spools of war table? Uh, let's see. We have you can one, either two, roll, three, four, uh, five ships that we're getting yes. dice on. You can roll once on the special spools of war and four times regularly, or you can roll... Um, Three, two, 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 two. Eight, um, Eleven times on the regular table, or uh, four well, we, times on the regular table, and once on the special. We burned through a lot of resources, and we got some damage. So I think once on the special table, and three, or and the rest on the regular. Okay. Yeah, that sounds uh, good. Mm. I'm gonna get five dice for you if you want to roll them. And let's replace this black die with your blue die. Which will be the special table. They all look blue to me. Um, well, it only matters what I see, so. Ah. You right. got a three. I think you managed to suck on the special table once again. Yep, you got a furniture boy. <laughs> you got literally <laughs> the worst possible thing you could get. Again. Every single time. It's amazing. Incredible. I don't know. Those furniture has been coming pretty handy so far. <laughs> oh, people are saying that yeah, I'm, I'm, you're actually correct, chat. Uh, you do get to roll again. I'm just going to go ahead and roll it. You actually get all those rolls regularly. 
Uh, six, six, four, five. Well, that was actually three. You're gonna get a lot of stuff. I like a lot of stuff. That you do. Uh, the sixes mean that you get um, a relationship increased by one twice with the target of your choice. Nice. Remember, when you increase a relationship, you reset the support box. Nice, dude. I'm going to do Tama. To Someone clear. talk me out of using any of my support boxes. Uh, correct. I mean, I ignored, the, I ignored all warnings and used two of my support boxes, so that actually works out perfect. Tama, you supported Nagato. Yeah, she got uh, hers back oh, yeah, from right. the... Uh... Okay. Well, I'm, I'm increasing... Oh, yeah, you did. Anyway. I was like, I, I warned you, but you did it anyway. You're right, I did do it anyway. But it's good, because now uh, I increased my thing with Nagato and reset it, so... Yeah, I mean, problem solved. Uh, six gunpowder, eight steel. Steel! Uh, 20 bauxite. Nice. Have some box egg curry. Get back to beast. I don't think he can store it all. Uh, you have That's one used up pretty it. quick, so. You have 1d6 plus 5 that you can spend on anything. What would you like to pick? Uh, steel. 11 steel. Nice. Okay, you make it back to base where Haruna is waiting for you and helps each of you out of the water and just keeps giving you a thumbs up and patting all of you on the back, except for Nagato, who she pats on the head before you get out of the water from the docks because it's the only time she can reach her head. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> uh, and that is where we are going to end the first half of the session. When we come back, we'll be back at the Naval District once again, doing keywords and preparing for the decisive battle. Uh, this is first half second half go watch some commercials uh listen to some music maybe support us all on our various twitters twitches youtubes etc uh that's all i got we'll be back in eight minutes